up guys so welcome to a new video my name is frank and i react to melon music today i'm here again with one of my favorite uh bands that i discovered on this this channel for sure 100 percent uh which is bandmate uh wow they really are making me love uh you know art rock or whatever they are playing because they as a japanese band they make a, a fusion of a lot of uh, different music genre, but I feel like that their main one is uh, art rock, you know, and maybe punk rock too. They're like the, ma the main first ones, but yeah. Today we are here with another instrumental, uh, which is Dice, and I managed to find this video on YouTube, but it's very crappy quality. It's only like 250p or something like that but it shouldn't look too horrible for you guys because you are going to see it like in a smaller window here right so let's let's hope that but uh, the audio quality should be decent at least and what to say i'm really really digging uh, their instrumental uh, versions of their songs because i'm able to hear everything they are playing as a guitar player myself i really enjoy mm, hearing kanami and of course all the other instruments but uh, of course guitar is my favorite and I especially really, really like the drumming because a Akane is a beast. Let's, let's face it, it's, she's like, she's really is a gorilla, basically, but a, a super talented gorilla. <laughs> and beats those drums like they owe her money for sure. And yeah, before I start, guys, uh, I'm very excited about this, if you, if you can tell. <laughs> before I start, consider subscribing to the channel because I'm trying reaching 1,000 subscribers, so you would really greatly help me if you subscribed because uh you know i'm like 620 i think right now so getting there like less than 400 i can i can do it i can do it <laughs> uh, and uh, give me a like and a comment if you have more suggestions for me uh or just want to say hi and let's start so excited <laughs> uh, yeah this intro with misa soloing with our bass Potato quality video. Of course, it's a uh, real upload from their DVD, so yeah. Man, I really love that uh, main riff. That da 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 Very cool rhythmic part here. Nice. We really, really love what uh, Akan is playing here. And this verse here sounds super happy and heavy at the same time. <laughs> Main riff again. Man, I love this riff. I kind of want to learn it on guitar, like later, after I reacted to this. Ooh, this part here I couldn't really hear well in the normal song. Very punk rock, this part, I think, right? But happy punk rock, basically. Okay. Misa Solo. God, I love this part. And Kanami Solo. Okay, before the slowdown, 
I gotta say, I particularly really, really love the main riff in the song. It, it got stuck in my head, like, uh, since the first time I heard it, like, uh, months ago uh, now. And I always wanted to learn it, but I forgot, but now I remember. I think after, right after this, I'm gonna pick up my guitar and try to learn it. It doesn't seem uh, too complicated uh, to learn, but of course, it sounds super cool. And it's got a little bit of the that Asian flair uh, for me, for some reason. Uh, it must be like the, the chords, like the combination of chords that... I don't know, it's kind of sound like a bit of, um, you know, Asian, Asian, Asian like for me. But uh, I really, really dig it. Uh, I love the drumming in the song. Uh, I can, like in the instrumental right now, I can hear what Akane is playing and it's amazing. I can hear so much more here and yeah, she definitely is a beast. And of course, one of my favorite uh, parts in the song, as always, like I think uh, as of basically 90% of main main songs is uh, what Misa is playing because she's sewing like crazy with her bass and keeping the, the time, like the tempo with uh, the drumming at the same time and her switching like, wow, she's amazing. Uh, she's definitely my favorite as always. Uh, yeah, definitely, definitely got a new appreciation for the song now hearing it in this version. I still uh, loved it like before, but now I think I like it even more. <laughs> Let's finish this. Slow down with the palm muting. Open course now, nice. Very cool transition with that bending. Like it. Pum, 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 pum. <laughs> that that ending got stuck in my head like uh forever pum, 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 pum. <laughs> so cool i basically never thought to finish a song that way it's so simple but yet so effective and so rememberable you know what i mean sounds so cool uh yeah definitely definitely I really like this song and as a side note uh, you guys uh, do you uh, prefer uh, this version of their costumes or their last version or the previous previous version previous <laughs> previous version <laughs> Let me know in the comments because i gotta say maybe my favorite costumes they had was like the the ones they had like around 2017 ish like the one with the um, kind of maybe the short skirt and the ones with the uh psyche with the the dress that was open like you know with like shorter on the legs not not because it was more revealing ish but because it was uh, i don't know uh, looked more rock more rebel rebellious to me you know look now nowadays uh, their their last like uh, version of their costumes look amazing you can tell that they now basically made a lot of money and they're I, sorry, I, I don't know uh, a more elegant way to say this, but uh, they made all the money and their costume will look very expensive nowadays, right? You can tell they have like tailors uh, that are making their costumes and their costume look amazing and they look amazing. They look beautiful, but um, they look more serious now, I feel like, you know, more like, uh, except for Misa and, and maybe Miku. Uh, sorry, Misa and maybe Psyche, they look more like serious maids right now. And they look more like models, 
I gotta say, you can tell that they have tailors that made their costumes because look very, very professional. But the older ones, like the ones they had before, even the least, like least ones, they have, they had, they one, they one they had like in 2017, 2018 ish. I think are my favorites. But yeah, let me know in the comments and definitely love this instrumental as I loved all their uh, instrumental that I heard so far. Maybe without holding back, it's my favorite uh, between them all because it's the faster, the heaviest, uh, the most technical, in my opinion. And uh, yeah, definitely, I love that kind of stuff. So yeah, I kind of predictable, I think, musically wise nowadays, <laughs> especially for you guys that are watching uh, a lot of my videos. But yeah, definitely, definitely, really, really greatly enjoyed this one. And if you guys liked the video, please consider subscribing to the channel because I'm trying reaching. 1000 subscribers, so it would help me a lot if you did. Give a like and a comment if you have more suggestions for me. Definitely see each other in the next one. Rock on!